Hi everyone, it's Fitz with The Daily Delivery. Hope you're doing well. I am doing fantastic. And the Kansas State basketball program got its man. If you were on the internet on Saturday, you found out that Keontae Johnson, the former Florida player who has been on a journey of a recruitment since deciding to continue his college basketball career. And while about a month ago, it looked like K-State was his choice and then he made no choice and opened it back up. And you would have thought that he probably wouldn't pick K-State, but he did on Saturday. It's a huge pickup for Jerome Tang's program. Now, if you don't know the history of Mr. Johnson, it's pretty fascinating. First of all, he is expected to be healthy and his other legal and personal issues have been set aside. He's moved beyond them. Nothing has ever resulted in that if you followed that part of the story. But Keontae Johnson's health is a concern. He collapsed on the court while playing at Florida in 2020. It's believed to be a heart issue. He has a $5 million insurance policy that allows him to test his health by playing some games. And if he plays beyond that number, it's an unknown number, he forfeits the $5 million. So Keontae Johnson, by coming to Kansas State, is betting on himself. He looks like he's prepared to set aside $5 million guaranteed because he can't continue his basketball career due to health issues and risk his health, risk the $5 million, and become a Wildcat. And why is he doing that? Because he is an NBA quality player, exactly what Jerome Tang and his coaching staff have been in search of since they arrived in Manhattan. That kind of impact guy that can be the lead dog on a team of guys that are going to get after it. Johnson averaged about 15 points and eight rebounds as a big guard, small forward at, at Florida. It's believed he'll only have one year of eligibility at Kansas State, although that could change based on COVID rules. Johnson is a great find for Tang and company, and it brings them to 12 scholarship players, leaving them with one opening, which I expect they'll just go ahead and carry because they are going to need or want all the scholarships they can get for the 2023 class. And if you're following along with that at Go Power Cat, they already have two four-star recruits in that class. Jerome Tang is off and rocking in Manhattan. We will see if this team can put all the pieces together, because remember, they only have two returning players from last year and 10 newcomers. But fans are excited about Kansas State basketball, and for good reason. Tang and company are bringing in some dudes.